So in this landscape video, I'll be photographing in and around Cassiope, or Cassiope, depending on how you want to call it. There's so many stunning beaches around Cassiope, which is the northeastern end of um, Corfu. So I'm going to really get some nice sunsets and sunrises on the beaches around this lovely little village. The sun is over there, it's just about to rise in, in about five or ten minutes. So I'm just going to go down there to this beach. Um, I think that's an unnamed beach. If it's not, I don't know what the name is. Um, and find a composition looking towards Canoni and Bataria Beach. And then as soon as the sun comes up, I'll get some lovely photos from there looking out towards those beaches. The sun is just about to rise now, so there's some lovely rocks down here and the waves are just lapping against the shore. So what I'm going to do is set up a photograph, look at these rocks, go right back to those beaches and in the background, I don't know if you can see, those are the mountains of Albania, which make the best backdrop ever. It's so stunning. So I'm just going to set up now, wait for the light, get really strong and take a few photos. Obviously everyone has a different opinion, but I think some of the beaches on this peninsula of Cassiope are some of the most beautiful beaches in Corfu. So in the foreground here, this lovely white pebble beach is called Bataria Beach. Um, in the headlands on the back there, um, that goes over to Canoni Beach. And right over in the distance there, you've got Pipitos Beach. This beach behind me is Bataria Beach and you can see why it's one of the most popular beaches in Cassiope. It's got really beautiful white pebble beaches so it reflects the sunlight. You've got these crystal clear turquoise waters. This definitely is the place to relax. And at the moment it's only about seven o'clock but soon this place will be filled with people enjoying the sun. I just found this other lovely beach back here um, I think this one's called Pipitos Beach, but I'm not entirely sure. But this has got some lovely um, shallow pebbled beach. But over, over that side there's, there's loads of rocks. And at the moment the sun hasn't quite hit everything, so I might just do a few photographs around here um, before the sun rises. Because there's little bits which are captured, capturing the sun. It's just like glinting on some of the rocks and some of the grasses and things like that. And I think that might make an interesting photograph. Just walked around the peninsula a little bit more and we've got Pipitos Beach in the background there. And I found some lovely, this rock sand fire stuff again, whatever it is, down here. So I've put that in the foreground and these rocks lead out into the beach. And I've got a landscape from this taverna over in the, in the background up there, going all the way around, including those, those little villas at the back there. So that should be a nice panorama or landscape 
um, and hopefully I should be picking up this lovely turquoise colour in this water. It really is a lovely colour. I don't have a polarising filter on this video so I won't be able to pick it up very well but uh, you should be able to see the colour down here. Now that is some beautiful water. Um, unfortunately we don't get it that clear in the UK, but um, I think Cornwall and a few areas down there are very clean, but most of it you don't see the water like that, so that really is beautiful to see. So we've got Pipitos Beach over there, and facing in the other direction, and we're looking up north, you've got this lovely collection of rocks down here going into the sea and the water is so crystal clear. I've put a polarising filter on it to try and cut off the glare of the water so you can see right into the water here and you can see the absolutely beautiful colours. Um, I think that should make a really nice photograph. This is such a lovely beach and such a, kind of a pen peninsula off um, Cassiope so this whole peninsula is so stunning. The beaches on here are amazing and personally I think they're some of the best on Corfu. So I've just come around the headland now. Right behind me over there is Bataria and Canoni Beach. And I'm not sure what this one's called. I think it might be an unnamed one. There's nothing on the maps and there's no signpost or anything. But this one is the furthest north out of all of these beaches. And it really is just a rocky beach, but it's such a beautiful one for landscapes. So we've got these lovely rocks here with some beautiful light on them. The sun is just rising, it's probably been out for about five minutes now. So we've got some beautiful light. You've got the lovely Albanian mountains in the background. But there's crystal clear water and these amazing rocks in the foreground. So I'm just going to look around now for some compositions and hopefully get some really good images at this little beach. I found a really nice composition using this relatively round boulder in the foreground and we've got this lovely rock in the background which is going leading into the sea and it's got these lovely striations which lead the eye through the photograph all the way across the sea into the mountains in the background. About 10 minutes ago this really large ocean liner went past and after a while between 10 and 20 minutes depending on where they are you get these massive waves come through from the wake from the motors and there's still bits coming in now so you can see as soon as we get a really big wave hitting these rocks you get some really nice um, splashes and white water so that's the time I've been taking the photographs so I've taken a few photos of these um, because every, every time the wave comes in it's going to be a different strength so you're going to get a slightly different um, composition, the water is going to fit, cover some rocks and not others and you just don't know so I've taken quite a few of those now and I'm going to choose the best one um, later on when I've put them onto my computer and after while well, I've been waiting I sort of realized that this this sort of composition here with this round rock the water this lovely rock in the right hand side and the mountains in the background it reminds me of a photograph that Joe Cornish took in Algol it's quite a famous one, um, so without realising it's a very similar image. So I think if you look at lots of images you subconsciously see those and you arrange your images um, in a similar fashion without even realising.
thank you for watching. I really do appreciate it. I hope you've enjoyed these videos as much as I've enjoyed making them. And the beaches around Cassiopeia are absolutely stunning, so I really have enjoyed making this video. If you've enjoyed watching it, please give it a thumbs up and leave me a comment. I love to read your comments. And if you haven't already, please subscribe and click the notification bell so that you get reminded the next time I upload another video. Goodbye for now.